What's up guys, Minute Badger here, bringing you another awesome gaming finds, a uh, pick up video. I think this is number 19 now, so we're almost at the 20 mark. Uh, we've been going pretty well, seem to be pretty popular with you guys. <coughs> So, I don't know if you guys can tell, but the sound might be a bit different in here because the padding has finally gone up. I plan on making a vlog about that probably this week at some stage. And the studio's done, uh, you can probably see the wallpaper's changed, the layout in the back's changed. But that's not why we're doing this video. Uh, we're doing this video for Game Pickup. So, all these games I'm about to show you are PlayStation 1 games, uh, which nowadays is pr are pretty hard to get a hold of. Uh, and thankfully they were all complete. Uh, got them for quite cheap actually, so I want to get into them. <clears throat> so first of all we have Gunfighter The Legend of Jesse James, which is a Rebellion game, pretty well known company. Uh, and from what I'm aware you can also, you can use the the Time Crisis gun, the plug-in gun, uh, which is pretty neat. Uh, that was complete manual in game, which is awesome. Um, some of the cases are a bit jacked up, but I mean, these cases are Pretty easy to pick up uh, out and about. Uh, we have Spec Ops Covert Assault. Um, <clears throat> this one was also complete if I can get it open. Ah, there we go. And some more nicely. Uh, I don't know if you can see that. Wrote on the inside, bang bang. So thanks for that. Whoever out there wrote that. Uh, we have A Bug's Life. Disney's A Bug's Life. I love the Disney games. I try and pick up Disney games wherever and wherever I can. <clears throat> this case was really jacked up, the front was all snapped, but it did come with Game and Manual. So that was also extremely awesome. I got In Cold Blood, and that was a double disc, surprisingly. Never, I don't think I've had any PlayStation 1 games that double disc, and it came with Manual. Um, we have one of my personal favourites that I picked up, and it is Austin Powers Pinball. Very nice. And that came complete. Oh no, the case is falling apart. <coughs> uh, these are the last two, and they're kind of um, the same in a way. Different games, same franchise. Uh, I used to play these quite a lot on my PlayStation when I was a bit younger, that's why as soon as I seen these, I jam at the, the opportunity to grab them. Uh, it is Army Men. Uh, this one's Lot and Load and it was complete. I think I actually played these on a PlayStation 2 as well at some stage. I'm pretty sure I got them. Uh, not these ones. These these, uh, these were only PlayStation 1 exclusives but the PlayStation 2 did their own version. I think it's actually, it shows you in one of the cases. Uh, and I got Army Men Omega Soldier. And that was also complete. And that's got a bit in the back there advertising, you know, the original. But hold on, I'll actually show you. I think it's the first one that I just showed you. It's got a bit in the back showing you. Um... Yeah, there you go. So, PlayStation, they had Army Men, Sarge's Heroes 2, and Army Men Green Rogue. I think I'm going to try and pick them back up at some stage for my PlayStation 2. Because I'm pretty awesome. I'm playing a lot of Star Wars Battlefront lately. Uh, on the original Xbox and stuff. But anyway guys, that was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight? Seven. No, I can't count. I can't keep that. Xbox. Seven awesome PlayStation 1 games. Uh, it's really hard to pick up PlayStation 1 games nowadays. And <coughs> I was so glad to get a load that I hadn't, obviously, uh, didn't have my collection. So the PlayStation 1 collection grows you may possibly have also realised, everyone, that my hair has now not grown and it's got shaved. So yeah, enjoy that. But that's everything guys, until I think my next video I'm going to be doing is quite possibly gameplay. Um, I'm recording this now, but I'm assuming it'll go up on Monday. Um, I'll probably do a vlog this week at some point as well and like let you see the studio but I hope I hope guys that the, the sound does sound better, it doesn't sound as echoey. I don't think it does. I'm talking just now and it doesn't sound as bad, so fingers crossed guys. Uh I also mean I'm gonna have to get more padding. But as I always tell you, remember to uh like, subscribe, share, everything, you know, favourite the video, everything. 
uh, and also go over and check out the Minty Badger Facebook page, there's links in the channel art and Twitter. Uh, Facebook's a bit, I mean if you want to follow me over on Twitter guys, that's, that's lovely, that's more, more than welcome. But Facebook is probably your best bet because I do uh, add extra things to my Facebook like pictures of when I get new things in or show new uh, little teasers of new videos that are coming up and things like that. But yeah, definitely go and check the Facebook page out guys, that, the, the community over there seems to be growing, uh, has been growing for the past couple of weeks, it seems to be getting bigger. Uh, so you guys must definitely be listening uh, about going over and checking it out. But yeah, that's everything I think I've cleared up here. So until my vlog or my next gameplay video, I have been the Minty Badger, you have been awesome as always, and until next time guys, peace out.